Microscope. Microscopes help the scientists to study the microorganisms, the cells, the crystalline structures, and the molecular structures. They are one of the most important diagnostic tools when the doctors examine the tissue samples. Microtome. A microtome is a cutting tool used to produce extremely thin slices of material known as sac. Centrifuge. A centrifuge is a laboratory device that is used for the separation of fluids, gas or liquid, based on density. Separation is achieved by spinning a vessel containing material at high speed. The centrifugal force pushes heavier materials to the outside of the vessel. Spectrophotometer. Spectrophotometer is a device used to measure the intensity of light as a function of the color of light. In clinical laboratories, spectrophotometers are used for many applications such as quantitative analyses, kinetics, spectrum scanning and multiple components DNA, protein testing. Autoclave, an autoclave is used to sterilize surgical equipment, laboratory instruments, pharmaceutical items, and other materials. A very basic autoclave is similar to a pressure cooker. Both use the power of steam to kill bacteria, spores and germs resistant to boiling water and powerful detergents. Analytical balances. Analytical balances are extremely sensitive laboratory tools which were developed to correctly measure small masses in the laboratory. Magnetic stirrer. A magnetic stirrer is a device widely used in laboratories and consists of a rotating magnet or a stationary electromagnet that creates a rotating magnetic field. This device is used to make a stir bar, immerse in a liquid, quickly spin, or stirring or mixing a solution. pH meter, a simple and speedy device to measure the acidity and alkalinity of a fluid. A pH meter acts as a voltmeter that measures the electrical potential difference between a pH electrode and a reference electrode and displays the result in terms of the pH value of the solution in which they are immersed. Laminar flow cabinet. A laminar flow cabinet or tissue culture hood is a carefully enclosed bench designed to prevent contamination of semiconductor wafers, biological samples, or any particle-sensitive materials. Air is drawn through a HEPA filter and blown in a very smooth, laminar flow towards the user. Gel electrophoresis. Agarose gel electrophoresis is a well-established technique routinely used in clinical laboratories for screening protein abnormalities in various biological fluids, such as serum, urine, CSF. Electrophotograms are evaluated visually for the presence of quantitatively or qualitatively abnormal protein bands. Freezer. For storing blood samples and medical samples, the ultra-low deep freezers are widely used in medical laboratories and for industrial purposes to store chemicals, bloods, tissue cultures, and other medical samples that can only be stored and preserved in low temperature range. Micropipette. Pipettes and micropipettes are invaluable pieces of laboratory equipment used to draw up, measure, and deliver accurate volumes of liquid. The difference between the two is that micropipettes measure between 1 and 1,000 microliter, while pipettes generally start at 1 milliliter. Incubator, a laboratory incubator is a heated, insulated box used to grow and maintain microbiological or cell cultures. The incubator maintains optimal temperature, humidity and gaseous content of the atmosphere inside. Hot air oven. Hot air oven is widely used in the medical industry to sterilize the equipment and other materials that are used in a laboratory. It is used for delivering the heat treatment to the product. As far as medical industry is concerned, the sterilization process is not restricted to dry sterilization or dry heating. Water bath. A water bath is a device used in the laboratories to incubate samples in water maintained at a constant temperature. Temperature may be controlled digitally or by a dial and once set, the water bath cycles on and off to ensure constancy of the temperature.